costume change perhaps a quick sip of water they just popped the loo they're back now i talk when i get nervous i don't know what's happening <laughs> Welcome back to another video. I'm Jennifer Galatsofa, a musical theatre performer, a voice teacher, and today I will be analysing and reacting to this gem that's been requested several times. <laughs> I will be reacting to and analysing Ghost Love Score by Nightwish. If you haven't checked out my previous reaction to her, then go check out here where I listen to The Phantom of the Opera with Hank Pocht. But this has been requested multiple of times and it's finally come. The time is here. This is over 10 minutes long. I had no idea. So I'm going to try my best and not pause. I know. Hurrah! <laughs> Let's see how it goes. I'm sure a lot of emotions will come through me. Um, I'm really excited. <laughs> Before we get on to the video, do consider hitting that subscribe button and the bell button to be notified whenever I post. Let's go. Look at the live audience, I miss it. That synchronization as well of the lights and everything. I feel like this is just setting us up for what's to come. <laughs> this is so much drama! Oh, a contrast. So much space. Look how still her body is because obviously how long these notes are. Oh, this is so fun. So relaxed. I will go and pause there really quickly just to talk about what we've just seen. We have seen such a lovely classical sort of sounding voice, right? We're in our head voice, but actually we're kind of going through our mix, those as we transition through our first passage for sure we are blending those two together to get that support i love the arm position at the end really helping us with support and what i mentioned as well is that kind of um static pose that we've got again grounding getting that grounded stance from the bottom up just to help us just like i say with the voice if we've got a great connected chest we're going to be supported and anchored to the top that's the same with the body. Her mouth is super relaxed. We saw that in the other previous performance, just how relaxed her mouth is and the tongue. It's not getting in the way. Her soft palate is risen as well, so we can feel that, uh, we can hear that glorious open sound. Chimes. Connected here. Right. 
a little bit connected in that phrase. She's great. Oh, a breath in between a phrase there. I love the audience singing along. A little bit more thicker folds here. Yes, guitarist. I think as well, you can just tell that she looks after her voice because it's so smooth and so easy to her, right? Oh, what's coming? I'm scared. <laughs> I'm excited too. <laughs> Mixture of emotions. Oh, that was nice in the background. Where is she? Costume change, perhaps? <laughs> A quick sip of water? I talk when I get nervous. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> oh, the instrumental now is kind of like resembling what we've just heard her sing. It's quite um, classical sounding and angelic. Oh. They just popped the loo. They're back now. <laughs> on that behind listen to how bright that was behind Len what was that like quickly gonna go back just to hear that see she doesn't need to move her chin this it's not the chest reaching up behind behind we're in this tiny space it's that twang that's bringing that volume it's a belt style for sure but we're in a mixed belt Listen to that mix. So much sass. Yes. So much attack, but healthy attack to it, right? Oh, we've got an ad. <laughs> Yay. is feeling this, having a little break for a voice. Oh. Those hay screams are quite, um, it's a singing technique as well to get us prepared. And actually, oh, I, I love that she's including the audience and we're preparing ourselves for the ending. Kind of like warms up that area of her voice. Come on. Oh, 
classical that open space again staccato that's difficult Dance again to help us. Beautiful. Ooh, almost like a yawn, kind of mimicking yawn. She wasn't yawning, but I'm saying that sound. I just want to listen to it. <laughs> oh. Great, I'm going to listen back to that ending quickly. We went through our mix bell, our transitions, then we went a little bit more classical, and actually, those high notes, we knew she was going to hit them because of that classical sound. In order to get a strong mix bell on those higher notes, we need to get our voice used to singing in our head voice. In those top soprano notes, head voice, we need to be comfortable in there. It is scary because it's most people's, uh, or some people's, least preferred uh, register. But in order to get notes like this, we need to be comfortable in that area of a voice because all that is is that tiny thin fold but we are adding twang, adding that cry. See how relaxed that, let's just listen to it. So all this is just relaxing her throat, relaxing her mouth. And then we go up here, classical. We know that sound, we're getting used to that space. So, oh, we're very, very open. <laughs> How do you talk while being in that? Oh, we're very, very open, got that lovely space. Then on the same note, we're applying a little bit of that speech quality, but actually it's just all of that twang, all those annoying exercises. So we went from, oh, which is a lovely classical sound, to, my fail. What was the riff? really really lovely and all that is is we're not pushing up our chest voice and I know she goes higher again for the same thing there she's not pushing up her chest voice to get that loud sound it's that twang so much cry up there On that U, we're on an open U because of how high and uh, belted it is. We need that space, so that's what she is doing there. Oh, what a roller coaster. As I mentioned during that masterpiece, you can really tell that Floor looks after her voice. There is, you know, we can't just expect those notes to come out each and every time if we don't look after ourselves, look after our voice, listen to if our voice feels tired, take that rest, warm up our voice, cool down our voice. And she's going through these 
different styles that she does so wonderfully in the same song. That's incredible. This is cross training at its finest. We are not just a, a, a metal singer. We are not just a soprano, a classical singer. We are not just a belter. We can do so much. Let this show you that your voice can do so much. Just go with whatever feels right. If it doesn't hurt, keep going. Thank you for being here with me today and watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please go and hit that subscribe button, the thumbs up button and the bell button to be notified anytime I post. See you very soon for another video. Bye!